Ahoy mates and happy Friday and welcome to another episode of my blind bag ship series where I choose six items and load them into the Jolly Roger to open. So first up, I love these so much. We just got to open our LOL surprise mini suites. These are the capsule ones. You can get different ones in the surprise o -matic. Then let's, ooh, what do we do? Let's randomly go over here and grab a Disney Dorables little blind box. That's cool. Ooh, and I see something Blooper might like. I had to buy these online, but they have the baby surprise pets where you get the little wrap, and that is just super cute. So he will appreciate that. And then on this side, I have a Funko Paka Paka of the Villainous Valentines. Never opened these before. They have an interesting sense of humor. Cute animals with very wrong items that they're holding. And then on this side, let's go over here and down below. We have, oh my goodness, we have an Explore Momiji little doll figure. And these are made by Pop Mart. Oh, cool. So they also make the book series, which I also have in here. So really excited to see which one we get. I haven't opened those in a while. And then one more item. Let's grab from here and down below we have an lol so an lol surprise my my bad it's a lala loopsy little buttons minifigure very cute everything's loaded into the jolly roger i have captain hook and blooper who is really excited for this but first we start with the disney adorables <laughs> he'll be patient and these are the ones where you can get like two or three little figures inside So it looks like we have, oh, we have three <laughs> that slid out and away from me. Cool, we have three. So our first one is going to be Mr. Incredible himself, which is really cool. I have a lot of the Incredibles, almost the whole family. Let's stand you up right there. Then, oh, yay, we have Naveen from Princess and the Frog, yes. That's cool. Oh, so cool. Really excited for, for the new attraction. And then our next one, or our last one, it's hard to open. There we go. We have, oh wow, we have the Cheshire Cat, which is so cool. He's spooky. Um, is he like a color reveal? He's a solid turquoise blue. Let's find him on the checklist. I wasn't expecting that. <laughs> So it looks like our color reveal isn't like a color change, it's that one time like paint rub off, kind of like what we're going to do with the surprise pets in a second. It does say it could possibly stain fabrics and surfaces. Not my favorite type of reveal, but we'll do that when we do the other guy. And then it does say warm water, so my bad, we're going to have to do that right now because that one takes cold water. So I heated up some water and let us see what it does. So I'm just going to drop him in there. And there might be two chances of like a solid color and like sort of the invisible color one. And you can kind of see the paint coming off. Oh gosh, I don't want to touch it. <laughs> I don't know why they do this. I gotta put my fingers in there. So I'll just let him kind of like have the paint rub off. Ah. <laughs> Just leaves a weird like coating on your hands, your fingers, the figure. Oh. Ooh, but it looks like we have a really cool version of the Cheshire Cat. If if he's clean, he still has the blue on him. <laughs> Look at his eyes. Okay, they're they're fun. So it looks like we have more of the the clear one you can get perhaps versus the solid color. We're still gonna have to clean him up. I don't know if his wonky eyes are deliberate or not, but I think it looks extra cute. <laughs> and our water has turned like bright blue. It's really hard to get these little blue pieces off and it even stains like the paper towel I'm using. And judging by the picture, um, I think ours has the special crazy eyes. <laughs> okay, moving on. Blooper's been patiently waiting for the little baby surprise pets. I purchased these online from Target because I can't find them in stores anymore, but they're the ones that come with the adorable swaddle, which if you've seen past videos, they're a great fit for blooper. <laughs> so you get the little blanket, which can help you wipe off um, the colors. And then, oh, here's our swaddle. Is it a lion or a porcupine? I think it might be a porcupine. 
how oh it's so fuzzy oh he's gonna like that one <laughs> look at how precious these are so cute such adorable little mini figures so let's get our little animal character out and it looks like oh yes we have the little hippo what a cutie i love hippos and then it looks like we have the little hedgehog for blooper and here's a quick look at the collector's guide there are nine different swaddles to get look at the dinosaur my goodness that's cute we have the fuzzy hedgehog which is adorable and it looks like there's 11 different pets so our hippo will go from a purple hippo to a swimming gray hippo and then we also have to open her eyes so you can just take the blanket that it came with and just rub their eyes to take off the paint so it's a lesser version of what we do with the Cheshire cat but this one uses cold water and takes a little bit of rubbing but along the way you know you can make your figure look look creepy <laughs> before it's fully fully rubbed clean but still pretty cute see spooky so here's our cute little hippo with her eyes open you can take out the pacifier and then we'll put her in the cold water and she should change to gray. Oh, she has a little bathing suit on too. And while she's color changing, here's Blooper in his fuzzy hedgehog suit, which is nice and toasty and absolutely adorable. I love these swaddles. And of course you can put your little pet back in there, but you know, Blooper, Blooper gets first dibs in his videos here. And our hippos pretty cold and these color change so so well I've only opened one other but I was super impressed and here she is cute little bright red bow she has a little little swimsuit on and of course they'll change back as you can see it's kind of kind of warm right now but she gets a pretty dark gray she just needs to stay in there a little bit and here's another look she's in person she's a lot darker gray than the camera but again it's hot so she'll she'll change quickly but i really love the the bright bow the little outfit she's wearing these are just super cute let alone the swaddle <laughs> okay so that's a whole lot of cuteness let's go on to something more like a demented cute with these villainous valentines these are the funko paka paka ones i think they came out around valentine's day and they had funko pops to go with them too so let's see what we get. They're all holding some sort of weapon. Oh, these are always so hard now. Okay, there we go. So inside, oh, we have a bird, which is cute. And let's see, oh my gosh, these are so wrong. And so we have a rooster, which is a really cool size figure. And he's holding a bottle of poison. These are so wrong. It's all cute, and then you see the, the skull and crossbones, which is very fitting for, for the Jolly Roger here. Interesting. These are a nice solid plastic figure. Here's a look at the other ones. Okay, I like the hatchet cow. He's a 1 in 36, a hyper rare. So we have a 1 in 12, a common. And of course there's a Funko Dragon in this set, which, oh, that one looks cute. I would love to get that. And we have Precious, oh my goodness, and he says, I made a love potion just for you. Thanks. <laughs> okay, moving on from that one, we have a Lala Loopsy Tiny's little mini figure. And I love the classic Lala Loopsy buttons, which I really announce or enunciate my T's like kittens. <laughs> if you watch the bloopers, bloopers, and I will try to keep that as a regular series when I mess up, which is usually often. Ooh, our chicken's giving us trouble. <laughs> but, you know, it may not always happen, but I definitely want to include that as a regular series. Okay, so on to our little tiny. You know what? It does not feel like a doll this time. Oh, cute. We have Crumb's Mouse. Oh, that is adorable. I love all the Lala Loopsy pets. They're just as cute as the dolls. Okay, and then our last two items, just like that, are both mini dolls, mini figures. So we're gonna do our LOL surprise mini sweets. Love these. I've had pretty good luck thus far. And they're just a whole lot of fun. Okay, so this is gonna be 
your, oh wait, no, that's not a sticker, my bad. I know there's a sticker somewhere. Maybe it's inside these capsules versus the um, surprise matic ones. Ooh, this is like stuck on there. Oh, almost had it. <laughs> and then let's crack this open, but again, I'm gonna try to not grab the sticker out. So here we go. Oh, don't, don't, don't look at that. <laughs> and we'll just start with something small. I like to start with what feels like the shoes because that's not much of a giveaway. So inside, come on out. Okay, cool. We have somebody new. We have these purple and yellows. Cool. And then let's grab this. This feels like a headband which is also purple. It's a really pretty purple, so I'm loving the color combos. Hmm, this might be the bottle, so this will probably be a giveaway, but, oh, we have the Dum Dums Lollipops. That's awesome. The, the questionable mystery flavor. Oh, that's really cool. Here is the little outfit. Okay, which that's adorable. Look at the little jacket wrap. I don't know why my camera is not focusing, but it has such cute detail. It's the mystery pop from Dum Dums. There's our little bag. Make life pop. Love the little question marks throughout. Again, so well themed. Oh, then we have some funky glasses, which are really cute. They almost look like ears, so those goes off to the side. And then here is our doll. She's doing the splits. Oh wow, she's really cute. I like her hair. So let's get her dressed. And on the checklist, her name is Mystery Pop Cutie. She is a common. Again, I really love the jacket. She has a lot going on with those glasses. So I'm gonna usually take those off. She's really pretty and then she also has her sticker, which I love that they come with the candy piece they represent. And our little baby hippo can perfectly wear her glasses, so that's great. There was a lot going on, so now they can just hang out together and stay away from that rooster. And last start for this video, I have one of the Pop Mart blind boxes from the Explore Momiji series. These are super cute. They also have the Bookshop series. I would love to get Nora, who is this little Yeti, but they're all adorable. And this is one of my first Momiji series I ever purchased. I mean, I love them. There's like a, a Christmas holiday one. There's a carnival one, but those are a bit older. And then of course the bookshop. Okay. So here's our blind bag and inside, Oh, cute, we have this little mermaid, which is perfect for our sea-themed video. Oh, I love the hair, and then it kind of swirls into the tail. She has a little boat on top of her head, or I should say it's more like a little sailor hat. That's really cute. And then here's her card. Her name is Cher, and it says, I like sapphires and denim, and kindness ripples outwards and eventually creates waves. That is true. Such a beautiful figure, and they are really heavy duty figures. Love the little star cheeks. Very cute design, and that's a great way to, to end a very interesting video. Here's a look at everything we opened today. You guys will have to let me know which was your favorite item. Feel free to leave me a comment down below. I always enjoy hearing from you guys. Ooh, as for me, there's a lot of cuties and one that's just wrong. So it's going to be a two-way tie with our hippo figure with swaddle. That counts as one. And then mystery pop cutie. I really love her vibrant colors. And just overall, those mini sweets are just awesome. And of course, blooper loves his swaddle. So a happy blooper is a happy video. So uh, that'll do it for this week's episode of My Blind Bag Ship. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, feel free to give it a thumbs up. And I want to thank you guys so, so much for watching, liking, commenting, subscribing. I really, really appreciate it. And I hope to see you in the next one. Until then, take care. Bye-bye.